So here is the thing. Everyone is talking about using AI for print-on-demand, but most people are barely scratching the surface of what's actually possible. I've discovered that the sellers who are crushing it right now aren't just using AI for one thing, they are using it strategically across their entire business. So in this video, I'm breaking down the 10 most powerful ways you can use AI to supercharge your print-on-demand business. And I'm not just going to tell you what to do, I'm going to show you exactly how to do it, step by step. Let's get into it. So the first way to use AI, and this is foundational, is for niche research. But we're not going to ask AI to just give us niche ideas, because that's lazy and everyone actually gets the same results this way. Instead, we're going to use AI as a brainstorming partner to unlock your unique insights. Here's exactly how I do this. I open Google AI chat, but you can do it in ChatGPT as well, and I type this prompt. I want to start a new print-on-demand business. Ask me a series of questions to help me come up with ideas. Now, watch what happens. AI starts asking targeted questions like, what hobbies or interests do you have? What communities are you part of? What kind of humor you enjoy? And this is so much more powerful than just getting a list of niches because you are finding gaps that are personal to you, which means you're actually motivated to work on them. And this way you're able to find a specific niche instead of a general one. Instead of dog shirts, you want something like funny golden retriever mom shirts for women over 40. See the difference? Okay, so once you've identified the niche, the next thing you need to do is analyze what's already working in it. And AI can do this in seconds instead of hours. And I'll show you my exact workflow. I'll search for my niche on Etsy, let's say funny dog owner shirts, and I will look at the top 10 best-selling designs. Then I will take screenshots of these designs and I'll go to Claude and upload all of them at once. And then I will ask, analyze these top selling designs. What patterns do you see in terms of design style, color schemes, typography choices, humor style or messaging, and target audience? And then suggest three unique angles I could take that would stand out while still appealing to this particular audience. And just like that, Claude gives me a complete competitive analysis that would have taken me hours to figure out manually. It identified patterns that I might have missed and it suggested unique angles that aren't being done yet. All right, now that you know what's working in your niche, you need to create your own unique concept. And this is where AI really can help you out. I can go with the first specific unique concept that Claude suggested and ask, I need t-shirt slogans for dog therapy series. The tone should be funny, give me 20 options, each under five words. See the results. AI took the specific context about my audience, their pain points, and the tone that I wanted. And this way you can get slogans that are actually unique and targeted. For example, instead of just something like, I love my dog, you might get ideas of slogans like this. My therapist, has paws, or four paws, zero judgment, or my shrink sheds everywhere, or therapist's couch is mine. These are way more interesting and specific to my audience. Now, once you've got your concepts and slogans, you need to actually create the designs. And this is where most people hit a wall. Maybe you're not a designer, or maybe you are, but creating dozens of variations is just too time-consuming. Either way, you need a faster solution. This is why I wanted to show you today this new AI tool in my workflow for print-on-demand. Just look at this, Kittle Flows. This is not just another AI tool to generate images. It's specifically built to help you explore creative variations and do it at scale, turning one idea into dozens of design options in just a few clicks. What how this works? Go to Kittle using the link below and create a new project. We can start with this uh, square size, then check Kittle templates and choose creative flows. 
This is where you will find Kittle flows. You can explore some of the flows that are already available on the platform as templates. If you want to start from scratch instead, you can just upload your successful design and through their AI integration with Nana Banana, for example, you can make a lot of variations. See here, simply add a new smart board from the original design. I just type a prompt, create a new design in a similar style for another quote, and I insert my quote. That's it. New design is ready. I just need to click on convert to image. In my case, I could just remove the background as this was such a basic text-based design. But sometimes you might want to vectorize your image to work on it a little bit more. Anyway, you can do all of this here in a few clicks. Just like that, you could generate 10 different quotes with similar design, assuming this particular style is selling well in your store. This is truly a way to scale. You can expand to more products, take that same design and put it on t-shirts, mugs, phone cases, stickers. One design can become 10 different products. I'll put my partner link to Kittle in the description below. And don't forget to use my coupon code AnastasiaYT to get 25% off. And by the way, starting on the 1st of November, Kittle is making many of its most popular AI models completely free for everyone. No pro plan or payment is required. But when they're gone, they're gone. So take advantage of them. And once you've got your designs, now you need to write product descriptions that actually convert and rank in search results. Let me show you my exact process. I will take a screenshot of my design and upload it to Claude, and then I will use this prompt. Write me a product title and description for this t-shirt design. And actually, this prompt is quite long and detailed, so I'll show it to you on the screen. You can pause the video and copy it for your own products. While it works, I'll show you the design I uploaded. Okay, now Claude gives me the titles and descriptions that are optimized for both humans and search engines. And here is where most people get stuck. They've got their designs, they've got their copy, but then they spend weeks trying to build an actual store from scratch. But what if I told you that you could have a fully functional, professional looking store built in literally minutes using AI. That's exactly why I recommend you to check out Everbe Store. This is an AI powered store builder that I'm using for this business and it's honestly a game changer. Let me show you how I built my store for those funny dog quote t-shirts that I showed you earlier. I go to Everbe Store. You can get a link to it in the description below and I'll click to build the store with AI. Then I just type a simple prompt like create a print on demand store to sell funny t-shirts with sarcastic quotes for dog owners. And in less than a minute, Everbee's AI generated for me a complete store with a professional homepage layout with product placement sections, email capture forms, about us and policy pages. There is also mobile optimization and the AI even tried to generate store names for me. And what's even better is that it integrates directly with Printify. I just go to the app section, click on the app market and install the Printify integration. I click install, then approve, then connect. And if you don't have a Printify account yet, by the way, you can sign up for free. I've got a link in the description as well. Once they're connected, I create a new store in Printify. I choose Printify pop-up store, give it a name and boom, my Everbe store is now connected to Printify for automatic fulfillment. No manual work required. I've got a special link in the description where you can try Everbe store for just $1 for the full first month. Trust me, this alone will save you weeks of setup time. All right, let's keep going. Now, here's something really powerful that most people don't think about. It's using AI to critique and improve your existing designs. Let's say you've got a design that you thought would do well, but it's just not getting sales. Before you give up on it, let AI analyze it. For example, I uploaded this design to Claude and I asked to analyze this t-shirt design and tell me what works well, what could be improved, uh, specific suggestions for typography, color, layout and messaging, 
and whether this design clearly communicates its target audience. And Claude gives me incredibly detailed feedback. For example, that the font is too bold and it overwhelms the delicate illustration that I created. So then I can copy and paste this feedback from Claude to my Kittle board and actually improve the design. This is like having a design consultant available for me 24 seven and for free. All right, so one of the biggest mistakes I see print-on-demand sellers make is being reactive instead of proactive. They wait until a holiday is here to start making designs for it. But the smart sellers, they're planning months in advance. And AI can help you do this strategically. Here's what I do. At the beginning of each quarter, I just ask Claude something like, I run a print-on-demand business in the dog-themed niche, so what are the major holidays, awareness months, trending topics, and seasonal themes coming up in the next three months that I should create designs for? And I'll ask it to prioritize by potential sales impact and give me specific designs, angle suggestions for each of them. Claude gives me a complete content calendar with major holidays, the obvious ones, niche-specific awareness days for dog owners, and trending design styles. Then I can work backwards and make sure that I've got designs ready to go at least four to six weeks before each event. This is how you stay ahead of the competition instead of always trying to catch up. And also, most print-on-demand sellers are leaving massive money on the table because they're not building an email list. And I get it, because writing emails feels a little bit overwhelming. But AI makes this so easy that there is no excuse not to do it anymore. So here is my workflow. Let's say I want to create a welcome email sequence for my new subscribers. So I go to Claude and I say something like, create a five email welcome sequence for my print on demand store. I'll say that my target audience uh, is small breed dog owners. I'll say the tone is funny and that each email should build relationship, provide value and include a soft call to action. Email one should welcome them and set expectations. Emails two to four should share stories, tips, or behind the scenes content. Email five should present an actual offer. And just like that, Claude writes an entire email sequence. Each email has a compelling subject line, engaging body copy, a clear call to action, the right tone for my brand. And you can also use AI to write something like abandoned cart emails, post-purchase follow-ups, new product announcements, seasonal promotions. The beauty of it is that you set the sequences once and they run automatically. Every new customer can get this experience without you lifting a finger. And by the way, if you're using Everby Store, they actually have a full-featured email system built in where you can import subscribers, send newsletters, and turn on automations welcome series, order updates, abandoned cart, everything. All right, another way to use AI, and this is huge for driving traffic to your store, is social media content creation. The print-on-demand sellers who are crushing it right now aren't just listing products and hoping that people find them, they're creating content that attracts their ideal customers. Personally, my favorite platform for free traffic to print-on-demand business is Pinterest. Its users are planners and shoppers. They're not just browsers, and they love finding unique products that they cannot get in regular stores. Unlike Instagram or TikTok, every pin links out to your website. So people naturally click through to buy something from you. Plus, pins don't have a short life of, say, 24 to 48 hours like posts on other social media. Pins can keep driving you traffic for months, even years. I'm getting on average about 50 to 85,000 monthly visitors to my website from Pinterest uh, for free. If you check my channel, I have over 150 videos about Pinterest marketing, so I know a thing or two about it. You need to create a lot of pins and you need to be consistent. You can totally start small, about 5 to 10 pins a day, and then grow up to 15 to 20 as your account builds. When you start, build your board on your Pinterest profile, grouping products in a similar way um, how you used to create sections in your store. And once you see some traction on Pinterest, 
And when you're ready to scale and grow faster, then you can check out a pin generator and a scheduler called block to pin This tool allows you to automate your pinning to the level you will not find in any other social media planners. You just submit your site link, block to pin analyzes your pages, the product images on your site, and it generates pins for these pages. They have a lot of vertical pin templates, but you can actually also upload your templates from Canva. And then it generates unique pin titles, descriptions, using the text available on your product page. And it also generates collage style pins with text overlay from all the images that you have on the page. All in all, it took me about maybe like an hour to get everything set in this tool, and then it generates pins for a whole month upfront. And then I can analyze inside the tool my best performing templates, best performing product pages, and create more pins around the stuff that's already proven to work. The beautiful thing about Pinterest is that your pins can get traffic for months, as I mentioned, or even years. And by the way, block to pin also works for Etsy stores, so you are not required to have your own store or your own website for this to work. All right, and a quick bonus tip. You can also use AI to handle customer service more efficiently. Let's say you get a customer question or a complaint, and instead of stressing about how to respond, you can just use Claude as your customer service assistant. Just paste the customer's message and say something like, a customer sent me this message. I love the design, but they do come up small, so you want it oversized or slightly baggy, go for a bigger size. Now, I wanted to write a professional empathetic response that acknowledges their concern, that provides a solution, that maintains my brain voice and turns this into a positive experience overall. Then Claude writes a perfect response that you can send immediately or maybe customize slightly. And this works for product questions, shipping inquiries, for complaint resolution, for return requests, and for general support. The faster you respond to your customers, the better your reviews are and your reputation. So AI helps you to do that without burning out. The sellers who are winning right now are the ones who figured out how to use this tool strategically to do in hours what used to take them weeks. So if you found this video valuable, then hit that subscribe button and the like button as well. And if you want to learn more about how to use Pinterest as a free traffic source for your print-on-demand store, then check out my next video linked up there. I'll see you in that next one.